The respondent said, in view of President Muhammadu Buhari's drive to fight and eradicate corruption, the sack of Abdurashid Mina, based on alleged complicity in two billion naira fraud, is a right step in the right direction. They decried a situation where someone who disappeared and was declared wanted by the EFCC was recently reinstated as a director in the Federal Ministry of Interior. They said the circumstances behind the return of Mina to the civil service should be properly investigated. He was recalled. I think the, that call didn't emanate from the office of the presidency. But Buhari, we all know that he has the zero tolerance on uh, corruption. He will not accept that. I think he has ordered that he should be sacked. Not even sacked. He should be sacked and jailed. Sack is a demonstration of the, the president uh, belief what he is known for. Zero tolerance to, to corruption. And I think it's a welcome development. When offenders are being punished, I think others will learn to behave rightly. Those corruptions level against him, since he abandoned, I'm not sure he's been properly investigated and, of course, uh, you know, tried for such issues. And so if it is surfaced and uh, in the presidency it is considered that there are no sufficient trials and uh, the presidency is not convinced that it's been properly put to book in, you know, in terms of corruption charges, then it's appropriate that it's removed. A legal practitioner was of the view that the sack was inappropriate as it did not go through due process. The civil service has procedure for the retirement and sack of workers. And one would have expected that uh, those procedures would have been followed, I mean query issued, and then uh, followed due process in the sack of workers. Uh, I think that it is not tidy enough to just announce on the pages of newspaper or order the immediate sack of uh, Mena. Mr. Mena, who was in 2013 dismissed by the Federal Civil Service Commission following a recommendation by the Office of the Head of Service, was reinstated as Director in Charge of Human Resources in the Ministry of Interior. Adesuwa Latu, reporting.